Biden's lost the step, but Trump regularly says things at rallies that would warrant a wellness check. John Stewart is back on The Daily Show and didn't waste any time ripping into Donald Trump and Joe Biden, calling it indecision 2024 electile dysfunction. Stewart effortlessly slipped back into his host role on the late night talk show, arguing age related issues are plaguing the 2024 election. They are the oldest people ever to run for president, breaking by only four years the record that they set. <laughs> Stewart mocked Biden's disastrous Friday press conference attempt to assure Americans that he was still up to the task of the world's most important job. The conduct of the response in, Gaza, in the Gaza Strip. Garbanzo. Stewart played a clip of Vice President Kamala Harris assuring that in closed door meetings, Biden is on his game. If you're telling us behind the scenes he is sharp and full of energy and on top of it and really in control and leading, you should film that. <laughs> that would be good to show to people. Stewart also noted special counsel Robert Hur's report that exonerated President Biden on the matter of mishandling classified documents, which also described him as an elderly man with a poor memory. The footage of the president unable to recall simple facts must have been brutal to watch. James Webb. I don't remember the names. Stewart naturally did not suggest this meant both candidates were equally flawed overall and quickly ran down his specific concerns about Trump. What the f are we doing here, people? He added of his critique of Biden, the stakes of this election don't make Donald Trump's opponent less subject to scrutiny. It actually makes him more subject to scrutiny. If the barbarians are at the gate, you want Conan standing on the ramparts, not chocolate chip cookie guy. For more on Jon Stewart's return to The Daily Show, head to the article on THR.com. And for the latest entertainment news and updates, keep watching The Hollywood Reporter News.